Sparky Bridge, not sure it's the smartest move, but prediction Skelly. Oh! What is up guys? Welcome back to Cold Town. Um if you read my pinned comment in my last video, I said today was gonna be the the like video that I had YouTubers guest guests appearing on and stuff. But that should actually come out tomorrow. I've already edited that video for like five hours and I still have quite a bit to go. But um I made a lot of progress and a lot of the assets will be used throughout the video. So the first bit of it is harder than the rest. So uh with that being said, as you may have seen, we are going to be doing a copy the deck challenge and I'm gonna do it in a grand challenge because I think it'll be more entertaining that way. Uh because more wild decks since I'm decently high ish on ladder. But we're gonna start out by just freaking going bloop, bloop, <laughs> and then picking at random and that's what we ended up on that looks disgusting and that's what we'll be playing i'm glad i'm glad i didn't get a like a top 200 deck and i got one of the replays that wasn't top 200 though so yeah we're just gonna be blindly copying whatever we uh we see uh from our opponent in the next game mg snipe what YouTube. Um, this deck is ridiculously heavy, so I don't plan on making the first move. Golem Graveyard. It gives me memories. Throwback. It's what I used in the first King Cup. King's Cup when I got second. I never lost with that deck. <laughs> I only lost because they made me play other decks, otherwise I would have played it every game. Golem Graveyard. OP. Oh, there we go. I guess we'll go cannon cart. Oh, that's aggressive. We'll go princess over here. I mean... I didn't really... I mean, if I had a log, I would have taken no damage there. It just didn't have a log. I'm up a lot of elixir, though, so... If he decides to pressure other lane, that cannon cart can still defend some. Otherwise, we're up anyway, so he probably won't pressure. Maybe we rage. Maybe we rage our graveyard. Maybe that's the play. But I think we should. I mean, maybe I go witch. I don't have ten elixir to play both right away though. Well, that's annoying. We're just gonna go with this. No. <laughs> Inferno Tower is very unfortunate. So he's playing log bait. Man, that start was pretty rough. We'll just skeleton army when he barrels. He decides to go for a rocket. Not that big a deal for us. He's gonna goblin gang it, but I couldn't get my wizard down in time. Yeah. So this is somewhat difficult. We deny most of the damage there. I think we'll actually be going, yeah, since he goes uh, Princess, we want that to be in the same lane. And he'll probably still play something. Or Log, that's fine. Uh, he logs that. We'll go Witch. I think I may attack that from this side, yeah. Ooh, that was a nice Princess for me. Go wizard! Oh, can't do anything about that. <laughs> no. I am in bad shape. Princess issue faster! <laughs> Alright. Well, didn't start out good. But in my defense, that deck was terrible. <laughs> and if it didn't have Inferno Tower, I think I could win that. You know what? Log bait's kind of like normal, so I'm gonna play another game with this deck, and then we'll we'll copy whatever the guy's playing. But log bait's I want to play wacky stuff, and honestly, I think I can win with this deck. It's just because he had Inferno Tower, and I have no way to do anything to an Inferno Tower. I also don't have anything that like helps me. Like if I had Poison Graveyard, this would be better. But I have Rage Graveyard. But we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Oh, well, that's aggressive. Pretty decent magic archer for him. But he does waste poison right there. 
Maybe you didn't need the witch, honestly. Golem in the back. I'm definitely up because he went super over aggressive at the start. There's the healer. Everything in my deck is so expensive. <laughs> I guess I'll raise this. Honestly, it made sure the battle hero actually dies, so it kind of worked. And I think we should win the 1v1 with that baby drag because of the rage, so. Bats mostly died there. Ooh, I think I can keep the princess alive by playing Skarmy here. Yeah, the E-Drag won't be able to kill it. And it's not damaging tower because of the Skarmy. So that Skarmy was good. Oh, no. I, I spoke too soon. But still not bad. We'll go him up again. Should once again have an elixir lead. I wish that princess had lived. That would be really nice. Double elixir is definitely where it's my time to shine, you know. All right, that's really a, that's really greedy by him. So we're just gonna let him get some damage there, and then we're gonna go in hard. I'm just gonna rage this instead of waiting for a, a graveyard. Now that poison's out of cycle, I can graveyard, but I don't think I need to. You know what? We're gonna take this tower, I think. And we're gonna go. Okay, this is fine too. I think I should be able to take. Yeah, he has no elixir, so. Honestly, kind of risky. I maybe should have just played something in the right lane, but it worked out, so whatever. Hopefully my wizard goes over to the left side somehow. Nope. <laughs> Alright, we're definitely going on offense. Victory! Yes! <laughs> Uh, okay. <laughs> I'll take it. And what was he playing? Oh, that stupid Eagle deck, but we'll play it. We'll play it. Dun, 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 dun. This deck's OP. He had poison instead of po uh, fireball instead of poison, but I played a deck that. What was it like? The last time, like two days ago, I posted a video on a deck, and then this is the only deck I lost to because it, I had no big spell. Oh yeah, the giant cycle deck. Rough matchup, rough matchup for sure. Okay. I think battle healer is kind of annoying for him to deal with. Um, and I can't play into the, uh, into the Sparky. Okay. Go E-Drag. Baby, and then just nato this back, I guess. Everything dies mostly. And this will be a really good counter push to play Elixir Golem on. He just decided to tank the battle here. Oh, he has no Elixir. Pretty sure that four Elixir was the only thing he had left in the bank, and he just used it <laughs> on a on a baby drag. I meant to play that Magic Archer one tile higher, but it's fine. And then we'll take tower before he even gets his elixir into the counter push, so. And he's gonna have to keep on defending it or he's gonna get three crowns, so. It's easy as that. You just defend and then plop down an eagle in front of your surviving units and it's very hard for them to defend. He just played a Sparky, but it's getting stunned, so I'm pretty sure I'll just three crown him because that's basically three, uh, six wasted elixir. The magic archer will three crown. Yep. <sighs> Eagle, the epitome of skill. Nah, I mean, that guy didn't play that well, but. So what is he playing? Some Sparky deck with, did he have Wizard? That'll be an interesting one, I guess. Yep, oh God. <laughs> I mean, no win condition really, we'll see. <laughs> we'll, we'll hope for the best. Ooh, Igor is coaching. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, 
This is either Expo or 2.6 Hog. Or neither. I was wrong. He's trying. He played his Ice Was there because he wants to activate. So I'm going to pressure even more. No, I can't activate King Tower. Or he's going to go for it. <laughs> anyway. I mean, I told you that's definitely what he was going for. But I didn't think he would do it after I pressured further. Um, I'm going at the bridge here over aggressively, like, uh, because he just wasted a NATO. Oh, it's Expo. It's Expo uh, NATO. That's what it is. Eh, I don't know if that's a good matchup for us or bad. Sparky's w bad because he has Rocket. We still got a lot of Baby Drag ship, actually. Uh, poor Decycle Log. Get back to a tank. So we have Mechanite Valk to deal with Expos. And Wizard's actually kind of okay. Cycle Bandit. If he plays Valk, I'm going to play a high Sparky. And then if he rockets it, fine. Otherwise, I got value out of the Sparky. So, Well, oh, he let me shoot. So I got value out of the Sparky. I'm just going to let that go. And then probably drop a Baby Drag all the way in the back. Unfortunately, I don't have a big spell. So uh, this is somewhat difficult. We need defensive expos. We'll just wait till double. We could potentially win off of tiebreaker. I should have went Mega Knight instead of Valkyrie. Alright, that was good. I think I'll just go baby drag here. Attack that a bit. Alright, we're a little bit ahead probably now. Got a Mega Knight in the back here. I'll pressure some. Ooh, he did that back too early. It wasn't in range of the Tesla yet. I'm just gonna spam with stuff because my, my Sparky's getting a lot of value. I don't know why he's not just rocketing my Sparky. He's gonna let Sparky shoot? Oh, I should have predicted the skellies. Alright, we got damage, so if he wanna keeps if he wants to keep on wasting time with defensive expos, then I'll let him. <laughs> I can just win on damage. I have no big spell, so it's kinda hard. This will be good. That was a bad Tesla by him. I'm just gonna, I, he's definitely gonna have to keep on defending. I'm gonna try to pressure him with uh, with Baby Drag. He'll have to Ice Wiz if he misses. Tower's almost dead there. All right, well, I'll let that tank and then I'll use Mega Knight. I was thinking he was gonna place his Expo on the other side. That was a weird log by him. We'll attack the, the Tesla here. Sparky Bridge, not sure it's the smartest move, but prediction Skelly. Oh! Rip, we're not going to be able to kill. I was hoping that would be enough to get a shot off. Oh, we still win, so whatever. Yeah, let's get that Mega Knight down, not through. Made sure I had enough time to play that, otherwise I could have played Valk. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I 
I'm gonna use that uh, the Sparky clip. Someone someone told me they didn't like my the, like my intro to the video with the teaser. Um, so I'm gonna use that Sparky clip. They're gonna he's gonna think they're gonna think I win the game because of the Sparky shot. But the Sparky doesn't actually shoot, but I do actually win. Big brain, big brain. Is he the coacher? What? Oh, probably Serge TS coached him. That's cool. Alright. <clears throat> so, we're going with the ice bow, and this will be the last one to round out the video. Uh, throw a log. And then I get back, I go back to my cave and start editing again. I've learned a lot, though, along the way with all the stuff I've been doing. We're just going to edit this to King. It's worth. Oh, we're pretty good against balloon decks, so overall this should be pretty good for us. So we'll drop an Ice Wiz, see what he does. Oh yeah, definitely go Expo here. Okay. Oh, he just double spells it. Well, I'm glad it didn't drop like a preemptive Tesla or something. Still a lot of damage for us. Especially because I need Tesla for balloons. I'd rather not have to rocket them. Gonna drop Valk here because he's gonna want to attack. Hmm. No, I don't think that's smart. Uh, I'll play like here, I guess. I have such good balloon, like lava defenses. If I lose this, it's because I played bad. <laughs> Rocket don't even need a NATO, and then we look to set up, set up an expo. Ah, we're not gonna get it quite out in time. He has like fireball arrows. I guess he could minions. Oh, mega minion. That was well played. I didn't really have anything in cycle. I would have skeletons it if I could have. I'm gonna pressure opposite lane some here. I probably minions it. What if I go like this? Um, he'll balloon and then I can NATO it to the expo. He should have fireballed the Tesla there. I feel like. Does that minor so rocket alone is enough to kill? Or does log cycle and then get back or get back to another rocket? Either one works. I guess I should have exploded like here and then tested the pool. Well, I don't know why I went that high. Because I can just cycle. There we go. And the dub. Check him out on Twitch, guys. He likes to BM his opponents. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I have a hard counter, so that's rough. Uh, but yeah, short video. Um, but I had, that was kind of fun. I, I should do this more, where you, you just play the deck of your opponent after each game. That was pretty cool, the blind copy challenge. Or, I don't know, some type of challenge. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, hopefully the, the video's out tomorrow. I mean, I'm going to post daily anyway, but hopefully the... The chef kiss video is out tomorrow. It's it's gonna be a collab with other YouTubers, and but I put a lot of work into it. So hope you guys look forward to that. Uh, I'll see you then. Peace.